Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel. Thank you again for dropping by. In this video, I thought I'd do two things. One is, say hi to everyone, give you an update of how my braces are having, are going. And two is just to have a generic kind of conversation and talk about the upcoming holidays and life balance and possibly two or three visits away from having the braces removed. Let's start with an update. My next visit is upcoming in two, three weeks. It will be the last week of December. They told me they're gonna do we, they're gonna do detailing that visit. I I believe detailing is marking the wires of the braces so that it will position the teeth or push and pull the teeth in the places where it needs to be. I go closer and show you how the teeth are pretty much gaps are no longer there. Right? You could you could hardly imagine or think that I had teeth extraction in front. So I actually had two, te two teeth extracted, but it doesn't look like that. I am very hopeful that I will no longer have braces before Valentine's Day. Well, it would be so nice if I can manifest that, there, that I will have this perfect smile, straight teeth, hopefully white and not too yellow and no marks by Valentine's Day. And that will be a great uh, milestone where I can have a Valentine's Day picture with my husband and my son, and I could have a full on confident smile. Yes, yeah, so look at that. One more visit after a detailing visit that they will remove the braces. And then voila, celebration time. So for those of you who are new to the channel, I've had my braces since August 2019. I have had two extractions in front and uh, before I had the braces, my teeth, my two front teeth are starting to form a butterfly like that. I, and then my lower teeth are all like this and kind of straight. My butterfly on the top, instead of like this, it's now kind of straight. I had two teeth extraction. For those of you who, didn't, who don't know, I also had my molars removed. It's not because of the braces, but prior to braces for, for health reasons or just wanting to uh, prevent crowding and easier cleaning. So now I feel that the teeth are straighter. This is when I do a resting bite where the top and the bottom teeth are meeting. If I do a, a resting bite that is like the top teeth is overlapping the lower teeth, it would look like this. Very excited. I think I would like to see how I can whiten my teeth more. You have corn looking tooth in here. And I wanna achieve that nice smile, straight teeth smile and a lot wider teeth smiles. That will be my next venture. Once the braces are removed, I will try the white strips, the whitening strips, and I will consult with our dentist if there's another way of whitening the teeth in in an affordable way. We really want to spend so much money on that. So that is the update. Uh, in two, three weeks, I'll be back for a detailing session and then hopefully one more visit. And then my braces are removed and by Valentine's Day, let's predict it or let's say it into reality that I will no longer have my braces by Valentine's Day. All right, so that's number one. Number two is just saying hi to everyone. How is your holiday preparation going? So in my case, I have started receiving my 12 days of Christmas from my husband. So he has this annual thing that he started long before we got married. So uh, ever since we started dating, he has, has done this 12 days of Christmas for me. So 12 days prior to Christmas day, gives me gift 
every night, every day until the Christmas day. So, so far I've, I've had received really cool gifts this year. I received a set of air tags. I received a couple um, incense burner, those stick incense burner. I love elephants and owls. So he gave me two ceramic elephant uh, are made in Thailand this by this very nice artist. So another one, he gave me a gnome stuffed toy. I love gnomes. In fact, I loved it so much that this year when we put up the tree, apart from the tree lights, all I did is um, put very minimal de uh, decorations of gnomes and that's it. I didn't have any Christmas balls or stars or anything like that. It's just a tree and then the lights and then some gnomes. So the gnome, the air tags, uh, the incense burner started 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So I'll get my fifth, uh, fifth uh, Christmas uh, gift tonight. So what's the other one? Yes, yes. He gifted me a CDC vaccination card holder <laughs> to protect our vaccination cards, COVID vaccination cards. So we've got three holders, like a passport holder, but mini ones so we can put your vaccination card in it. So pretty practical and uh, pretty cool. Holiday shopping is also done. Uh, my family is spread across the world and also his family is um, not where in the state we will live. It's a lot of virtual cards and virtual greetings and uh, e-cards or gift cards giving gift giving you're not necessarily physical gift giving anymore uh, i think this year is a lot of quiet time with each of our own families really focusing more on the time with the family and not necessarily being very busy about arranging a party and stuff like that. So it's really going back to the essential focus time with your loved ones, talking, spending time, whether it's just eating together or um, watching a movie together. So I am so looking forward to that. No pressure of attending year end parties or buying gifts for year end parties or socializing, but more about just connecting connecting with people who love, connecting with people who really truly care about us and who we truly really care about. Yeah, this I know the pandemic has been very, very hard, but the pandemic and, and the quarantined life has really put things in perspective for us, for me as well, personally, where it's going back to the essentials and focusing on those essentials of life. So yes, all right. Just wanted to say hi to everyone and I'll be posting another video once I finish my, complete my next visit for the, for the uh, braces and who knows after my braces are removed, it's all about lessons learned of braces or how do I maintain the retainers, right? Because I, I learned from the braces office or the orthodontics after the braces are removed, I will wear uh, the retainers for life. My son actually had his braces removed maybe a month or so ago. So he had to wear retainers and then the retainer, plastic retainer for 20 hours for the first two months, then just wear them at night while he's sleeping. Apart from those clear plastic retainers, we had metal wire retainer glued onto his teeth. He said it's a little bit annoying at first. I think that's the next journey I'll be sharing with you how that works for me. I wish you all the best. I wish everyone so much happiness and peace and prosperity. I hope you keep checking out my channel for the video. Thank you for all the people who comment. Yes, more wealth more health, more happiness, and more prosperity to everyone. See you next time. Bye!